Hey guys, Igor here doing one more tech review. Today, analyzing Flowlu, a business management software that they're having a lifetime deal now on AppSumo, and it's an all essential online tools to run your company from project and customers relationship management to finance tracking in one single place. So they have now uh, one, uh, one, time lifetime deal on AppSumo and they have their regular pricing as well. This tool is like Pluto or also Sweet Dash, another tool that you can think about that's like Flowloo. But Flowloo has been a huge success on, on AppSumo and they, are, have, they have more than 150 positive reviews. And the tool is really neat and can replace everything related to business project management. I'm going to show you right now how the tool works and the several options that you have on Flowloop. So you can see here, I have the onboarding section as well. So the tutorial is pretty simple to follow. You're going to have the tool here and you're going to have the onboarding sections as the first option on the menu. And then you have all the sections and they are going to direct you to fill out all the, the settings you need to use the tool smoothly. I'm going to show you the system settings. So the things that you can config on Flowloo. You can see here, you can change your account URL. You can now set up your custom domain. So um, you need uh, an AppSumo Professional Tree subscription plan to have your custom domain. So you need to buy at least three codes, but you can, you have here your custom domain. You can change the time zone, date format, current settings. And you have also an, I an IP whitelist features. They have an IPI. They have web hooks with web hooks. You can, for instance, use it with Publi. You can uh, separate your tasks and, you know, features on Flowloo using tags. And here you can configure projects, finance, everything related to Flowloo and also your knowledge base, time tracker. Okay. So everything is customizable. And here you can check, check the apps. So everything on Flowloo is divided by apps. So if you think that you have a lot of options here, you can just disable the apps. As you can see here, you have projects, tasks, CRM, files, my team, messenger, calendar, finance, workspace, time indicator, products, project issues, record list, mind maps, that's really cool, knowledge page, agile projects, time tracker, and email. So you have everything on Flowloo. You can manage all aspects of your business using only Flowloo. And you're going to be updated by their feed. So you have a feed here where you can check all your tasks for the day and also the birthday of your team. Here you can write a message and you have like a chat on, on your feed. You can even create announcements for your teams or a poll and then everybody can vote. Here is the task app management. So you have a to-do list view, a Kanban board view, a list view, and you can create templates for your text. Okay, so here's the list, Kanban you just saw, and here, here's the list. Here's the to-do list, and here's Kanban. And you can create tasks as templates, and then you just save it as a template and don't need to create everything again. Um, about the Kanban, it's the one that I like to use mostly. You just drag and drop, okay? Your tasks here and you are done. There is CRM on Flowloo with everything that you technically need to management your customer relationship. So you can create opportunities. So 
a contact or an organization that you will follow a sale funnel or um, an opportunity to, you know, increase your networking so you can create an opportunity and follow all the flows. Your CRM, you can distinguish between organizations and contacts, okay? You can divide your tasks by projects, okay? So as you can see here, there is a default project that the project that Flowloo used to create your onboard, onboarding on Flowloo. So you can see the task here, uh, the project here, and on the project, you're gonna see all the apps that you activated. So it's pretty, pretty simple. As you can see here, the time tracking, the tasks, on the, the views that I haven't shown you, I, I did show you. As we selected Kanban, so there are Kanban by default here. Your finance, your team, history, event, documents. So you can upload file, add folder, and divide your documents by folders as like a Google driver inside Flowloo. You can create notes inside the projects, manage your issues, create an org structure as well. You can see here your work structure with tasks, finance. So everything you're gonna see pretty organized, okay? I think it's more organized than, than NIFT. NIFT is another tool that you can um, compare with Flowloo. And I think the main difference is that Flowloo has more features. Uh, Flowloo is a more complete business software management if you compare it with Suitas or Pluto or NIFT. Here's our finance and you can create invoice, okay? So click here for a new invoice, pretty easy. Terms and conditions, customer notes, the sale person, sale person full name, the name of your product, the price. You link it with your project, or another number that you can customize. You can invoice with banking details, your customer, and it's done. And you can create a recurring invoice. So you can manage, for instance, monthly uh, membership with a recurring invoice. Uh, you can create uh, instimates here, include discount, ta uh, tax, shipping charge, line items. So you can create a custom um, estimative for your business. Here you have like a business money management when you can, where you can record your expensive, receive the payment, transfer. So everything related to finance and transactions, everything will be under the finance apps. Okay, so you have a complete um, finance uh, management project here. Here's your cloud driver. So you can see your folders. You can divide those folders by projects as well. And then you can add a folder, for instance, I'm gonna show you. Add folder, then you click here, and then you can upload files on your folder. I'm gonna just upload a picture, then you can see a picture, how it works. And I'm gonna upload also, let's see if I have a small video here. Okay, I can have a Excel sheet here. I'm gonna upload as well. I'm gonna upload a Word file. Okay, so they are separated by icons. If you click here, you can view your file. So it's pretty neat, the Google Drive that they have on the project management. You can even view your Word documents inside Flowloo with Salsum, okay? Here, Flowloo has a calendar where you can check your events and your tasks. You can set up your Google Calendar. So 
if you upload something on Flowlo or vice versa, it's going to upload um, on your internal calendar as well. So you, you have that interaction between the Google Calendar and Flowlo. Here you can invite people, uh, users to your team, clicking here, email name, last name. You can even set a password. It's pretty easy. You have products inside Flowlo, okay? So you can create products, the products that you're going to sell, then you're going to send invites as well. So you set your product, your product with codes, item type, descriptions, and you can even attach files and divide them by tags. You have an agile project inside, a record list, and I'm gonna. Well, I want to show you the knowledge base, so you can create a knowledge base inside Flow Loop. Okay, tests, test. You can um, authorize external access or not. Create a background, send the color, uh, customize with your logo. So everything will be white label for you. And here you can see how is the knowledge page. Pretty neat. There's a search item here, and you can divide it, um, adding articles. So title, tests, and on your article you can add a video. So you can embed a YouTube link, a Vimeo link. Okay, you can change uh, your text color, align, divide by list. Okay. So, testing, save. So, was this article helpful? Yes, no. There is a discussion. Okay. And you have that article inside your knowledge base. Okay. So, there is my knowledge base test with my article test. Here, learning more. You're going to direct to the article that I just created. They have also mind maps. Okay. So it's pretty simple to use the mind maps. You create a new mind maps. Yes, mind maps. And then you're going to use uh, your keyboards, keyboards, um, short codes to create your mind maps. Okay, there's a mind map inside flow loop. You can manage all your emails using flow loop and you can connect an account by using Gmail, Outlook, or even IMAP. So you can use IMAP if you don't have Gmail to connect your account from your other domains that are not Gmail. So for instance, you have, I don't know, 10 domains. And if you can create an email using uh, by your hosting using IMAP, you just configure it here with your hosting login pass server and the IMAP um, codes, and it's done. And you can manage your emails inside Flow Loop. They have also a time tracker. Okay, so you can track your task activities. Then you can charge your client based on the time of each activity and also the reports. Okay, everything that you create on Flowloo and that you use on Flowloo will have their own report. For instance, a task summary. So you click here, you see your task reports okay so everything is manageable with analytics inside flow loop okay so that was my flow loop review i hope you like it that deal i will completely rec completely recommend that tool i think it's really different it's really neat it has everything you need to manage your business with only one app I hope you liked that review. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.